Hello everyone and welcome back to Lego DC Super Villains. Let me get my input in. For straps on, yeah. Using them. And we'll be on our merry way. Leave this to me. Yes, I know, the Joker has explosive pie! And an explosive throne. Channel 52. It's a nod to the new 52. Did you hear that, Jimmy? Something's going on inside. What do you think it is, Lois? I don't know, but with recent sightings of Harley Quinn still on the loose, my hopes aren't high for this being good news. Was that Ultraman flying overhead? There's some serious criminal activity going on inside. If Ultraman and the rest of these stand-in heroes are here, then we need to see what happens. Let's see if we can get in. This gala might not be so boring after all. That's a VIP-only area, Lois. We don't have tickets. I doubt that matters right now, Jimmy. Hey, you got it working. <laughs> Ew! <laughs> Oh. Now that show had explosive drama. <laughs> Inmates, we are experiencing technical difficulties. <laughs> For your own safety, please remain in your cells. Come on, Joker. This leads down to the lower levels. <laughs> okay, that takes care of the easy part. Now where do we go? No idea, Moon Frozen Capitan. But I'm sure our criminal buddies will help us break out of this dump. Let's go ask them, shall we? You've got absolute zero chance against me. <laughs> oh, four times the studs. Free summer. Let's have some fun. Hang on. 
It is. This is the second video game I know of that Chris Summer and Mark Hamill have started together. The first one was a game that I only played with friends. The first Spyro game. Came uh, in the Legend of Spyro. Dawn of the Dragon. Our camel was Malfour. Free was Cinder. Huh. Neat. I don't know if it's a coincidence or just, you know. Yeah, I, I kind of remember Livewire a little bit from the anime. It's the animated universe. Hey. Too cramped in there. Time to stretch my legs a little. Reverse flash. He already know. <laughs> Look, if there's gonna be another Spyro game with Malfour or Cinder. I, I would like Mark and Pre to reprise their roles. You know, it just they just do a good job at it. Okay? Not that I'm saying that Jim Cummings didn't do Nail as Malfour or any of her uh, Cinder's other actresses nailed it. I'm just saying. And that, that would be a nice nod to the fans. Ultra fast tippy toe. <laughs> I love it. Okay. Huh. Oh, wall jumps. Thing I'm not used to. Joker's henchman. Need something? 
What is it, Chief? Way to build the bridge. This seems to be our way out, boys and girls. Do your thing. Hmm. I could deal with that fuse box. But we'll need to find a way to reach it first. I believe my power should be able to help with that. Alright, do your thing. Fire, do your thing. Huh? Neat. Tuned to electricity. That depends, Merlin. You here to help us or just slow us down? Oh, please, Thorn. Just because you spoiled our little trip to Star Labs. Guys, this isn't the time. Merlin, did you see anything that could help us escape? Well, since you asked so nicely, I think there's someone behind that security gate that could be persuaded to aid our cause. <laughs> they expect me to use this? I'm not exactly a magician, you know. <laughs> Oh, I get it, cuz Malcolm Merlin. Expensive. Yeah. 
There he is. Solomon Grundy? You sure it's safe to let him out? Nope, but I don't see any reason why we should let that stop us. Good answer. Seem our zombified friend is a heavy sleeper. No surprise there. Maybe I can do something about that. Grundy. Oh, it's a mini cosmic treadmill. Oh, it's like Sonic 2 special stages, except it's not Sonic 2. Yeah. Should be enough parts up here to build what we need. Supposed to work like that? You know what? Here's the exit. You can all assist me with my experiments. That's Dr. Hugo Strange! His experiments don't end well for those who assist him. My thanks to you, Joker. This breakout is the perfect opportunity.
to get more volunteers for my work. You're welcome. Sweet, is it Sparkham City actor? Like Robert here. Ew. Hey. You okay? Bobby! Oh, it's the guy from earlier. <laughs> I'm looking forward to seeing how you fare against my latest creation. Please try your best to survive for as long as possible. We're not yeah. taking that thing down without a plan, Joker. <laughs> I don't like plans. I prefer schemes and stratagems, plots and ploys, malevolent, mischievous machinations. Sure, sure, whatever you say, but just think of one, quick. <laughs> to wear him down. Wait! I can't use this? <laughs> Looks like the joke's on me. like a banana and split. Sorry, that should have been Joker's line. Shut up.
Oh, that looks bad. Oh yeah, I remember Joker's immune to has toxic. Just need a way to get out of here. Relax. I'm sure something will turn up. Ah! I'd like to say I knew that would happen. <laughs> Poor Robert. Oh, oh. Perhaps some kind of rubber shoe. Yeah, perhaps. Or sock. Thank heavens for small mercies. <laughs> What's this? A party? Ah, need a lift, pumpkin? Mr. J! <sighs> you think you can escape us, clown? <sighs> oh, thank goodness. Huh? <laughs> I take I made that it. as a yes. <laughs> ah, forget him. We have more pressing issues to attend to. Almost. Oh, wait, we did. Or not. Ah, 
back to the old clubhouse. This crime syndicate is worse than the Justice League. They don't play fair. They broke my favorite cold gun. They stood on my tail. They tried to use me as a casserole dish. I hear they got all the loot from the Batcave. <laughs> You've got to hand it to them. They're better at being villains than we are. I beg to differ, Catwoman. No one is better at being a villain than Lex Luthor. Huh? <laughs> Ugh, get off me, you painted buffoon. I didn't bust you out to play patty cake. I've been to LexCorp and seen this so-called crime syndicate. They're hunting for something, something powerful. <laughs> you can bet when they find it, it'll be bad news for the Earth, and more importantly, <laughs> us. Uh, Lexi, with the Justice League out of the picture, who's gonna stop them? Ooh, us. We can stop them. Indeed. And then we can take over. Precisely. Whatever their game is, if they want to play at being heroes, then we'll give them the greatest bunch of bad apples ever assembled. Do apples come in bunches? <laughs> we'll show oh. them how we do things on our Earth. But Ultraman is so powerful. We have our limits, Lex. Apart from the walking power absorber here. Hi. You don't say. Well, we will just have to recruit the strongest, most devious, most sneaky supervillain team this world has ever seen. Who's with me? <laughs> Excellent. First up, let's go get Gorilla Grodd on the team. Let's get out of here. Right. For now... Here gonna end the part here. I'll see you around, everyone. Thank you for watching, and bye bye